in the world of fragrance, making you smell delicious and offending you at the same time may be considered especially heinous. In New York City, a gorgeous Cubano and his elite squad of ball sprayers will seek out these colognes and investigate them. This is his story. Bitch. <laughs> Let's get the ball rolling with a little bit of excitement. We got a new release. Damn, Cuba's been hitting it out of the park. Can you understand how much debt I'm in? This is a new release, well, actually a limited release by Carolina Herrera CH Man. Let's roll my motherfucking music and give you my first impressions of what I think this one is. Bless it, morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. This is your boy, C to the U to the B to the A. I'ma jump right into the fuckery from beginning. Carolina Herrera dropped a limited release that dropped overseas before it hit the US, and the ones who got it early, early paid a pretty penny for this shit. It is a little bit pricey to say the least, but it's now more commonly found in other websites and online retailers. The fragrance that I'm talking about is CH Man Insignia. As you can see, it's got that retro Carolina Herrera CH Man vibe. Still with a little bit of a red stitching, only this one got a big old eye on it for I got y'all motherfuckers. First impression, which this is, I don't like it. It's not that great. But the difference between this one and the other one, mostly it's a little oodier and spicier. It's got an opening of cinnamon and saffron, giving it that little bit of a Middle Eastern touch. I don't know why it has, I don't like it. I was so hype on this shit when I heard about it being dropped and it was like a little bit of a hard to find for the CH Man fans, which I am. I was expecting this to be that fire, the new, new. No, it's a height, but it's not great. It's, I have it on my hand and all I'm getting is spicy saffron right from the opening and it's already dried down on my hand for about 25 minutes and I'm still getting a spicy Udi saffron with CH Men DNA. I feel like the cinnamon and saffron are so overpowering on this that it kind of takes away from the beauty of what CH Men is. It actually is a little bit abrasive on the opening. Right now it's dry down and when I first sprayed it, honestly I sprayed it on my hand and I got close and it pulled me back immediately because that spicy cinnamon was just too overpowering for me. This might be other people's cup of tea, it's just not Cuba's cup of tea. Unfortunately, this was not fucking cheap. Maybe it'll grow on me later on. I'm gonna give it more of a chance before I let it go. But right now, Cuba's first impressions of CH Man Insignia, this joint ain't a ball sprayer. There's really nothing more I can say about it. You definitely get the CH Man DNA, which makes me smile. But that spiciness is so overpowering as Middle Eastern pure spices tend to be, especially when they're prominent like they are in this, that it doesn't do it for me. I don't feel sexy wearing this shit. The other ones, I felt the sex exude through my pores. My dick got like four inches bigger just by wearing it. Right now it just shriveled up into my bag. CH Man Insignia, you let the boy down. I'm gonna put this down right now. I'm not happy. Y'all can test it out if you can get a sample. Test it out. Do not blind buy this shit. Don't go off the idea that I had that this is CH Man. There's no way they would fuck up this formulation. They fucked it up. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart and these unsprayed, slightly disappointed and shriveled balls. I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is. It's your boy. Fuck, man. Smooches. Fresh, who is best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Tell them who For the fly gun, hold a money folder, hold a roller, start when it's time to call back. Uh, for the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga gay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey, for all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse, sweet on top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would. <laughs>